Hi everyone, uh, this is a video I made with my Minecraft uh, city and today I'm going to show you vehicles. So that does not include the aircraft which I have shown in another uh, video. Uh, I'm going to show you um, well the land vehicles this time and I, I remind you that uh, these are all made in one to one scale with your player so do not expect to see something really fancy that looks like the real thing. Uh, this is uh, the, the work I could do, the limitations offered by, uh, well, the limitations imposed by uh, the one-to-one -one scale. So think of that as a Lego building where uh, obviously when you make a car out of Lego, it cannot look like the real thing unless you use thousands of Lego and you build it in a scale that permits that. So here we go. And this, I won't stay long here. I'll just show you two vehicles. This is the standard vehicle in just different colors. This is the last one I had made, uh, which is some of the other work I have made, uh, which a bit earlier, but much more varied. So you see you have the car, with the, the, you have the, the basic, basic, basically uh, I managed to put all the basic structures of the car, which is the front lights, the back lights, uh, the uh, area inside the windows where it's supposed to be, places for the driver and the passengers. And as you see, it's all one on one scale with uh, uh, with the player. Let's see just a second. Get away from the weather. There we go. And the other thing is just the same thing in different colors. And I'll just show you one of the military vehicles here. Just a transporter of troops, it's like a truck transporting troops. And here you can see at the back, you can actually go in it, go inside. These are the places for the passengers. And at the front, you see the driver's seat. Obviously, there's no wheel. There's another thing, other than being in one on one scale, there's another thing. I am using the uh, basic textures of Minecraft. There's nothing additional here, there's no add on for everything you see, just using the basic structure. So if you go now, this is a a military base outside the main uh, the main area, the, the main town, which is a little bit, a few clicks away from here. It won't be long. As we arrive, actually, I have put armored vehicles around the town. And uh, we'll look at those vehicles first. Just one type, basically, which you can go also inside. So that will be the first thing we'll, we'll see when we arrive at the town, which is oh, we're almost there. There we go, there is the uh, external wall, and here are these military vehicles, so we'll just look, uh, have a look at those first. So this is how it looks around. And you can actually get in from the top. Or whatever, maybe you can get out from the top anyway. This one, or I'm just not clicking in the right place. Anyway, you can get in from the back too. This is used for transport. And here you have transport for transportation of See, actually, it's pretty space inside. It looks actually it's like uh, those Doctor Who uh, TARDIS boxes. If you look at it on the inside, the outside, it looks like a, a nice sign. You wouldn't expect that it's so uh, spacious inside, but anyway, it is. So we go in, you have the uh, the drivers, the drivers is right here, you can see he has the uh, protected view in front of him, and then you can also get out to the supposedly tart up there, oh yeah, now you can get out at least. Okay, so this is one of the military vehicles, I'm just going to show you the other one, the last one. Oh yeah, here we have uh, fire trucks, ambulances and stuff, well, yeah, let's look at this. I even had forgotten I had made those. So here we have an ambulance. So let's see how it looks around. And let's get into it. So as you see again, attention to the detail. All my structures basically I have made in a way that doesn't just look good on the outside, but there is always an inside. Anything you see is good behind the walls on it. There is absolutely nothing in Minecraft City that I made that uh, that is just for looks. So on the front again you can see the driver and co-drivers uh, 
sit should have the controls probably just with the driver it doesn't matter so then you have a fire the fire department track this how it looks from the outside and you can go inside of course this place for the environment so that they can see it and you can see the controls the seats for the uh, driver and front passenger and next uh, next we have the uh, the trucks for the uh, army is the, the same structure pretty much with a fire truck so I'm not gonna get too, into it even so I'm gonna go further it's a military base right here it's the military part of the airport because they, they share that with the civilian airport over there and this is the uh, military airport does actually use the same runway basically but they have their own taxiway and here you see the military base, since we are here, I haven't mean, shown it before, so you got the place, so the cafeteria, and the barracks, and everything, and it's a lot more than you can see, because these things go underground, everything, every time I have something military, it is underground too, sometimes they are even connected to the metro uh, part of my, uh, of my city, so there's a lot of stuff, when you see building, is usually a lot more than meets the eye, so I'm gonna go over here, it's another military building and then you have the last uh, army vehicle that I'll show you these are tanks they are a bit smaller and simpler and here actually uh, this meets this looks a little bit more real because you have the slope on the front uh, the tanks the tanks are uh, usually slope on the front so they can deflect uh, at certain times of uh, tank uh, missiles Actually, this is one of the things that uh, has been worked a lot in the history of tanks. But anyway, it, it's not supposed to, to look like something that really exists. These are not replicas. And I didn't go to replicas basically because um, on one and one on one scale, I mean, you won't be able to do that. So it's just basically to make something that looks uh, at least basically like, like what's supposed to, like a tank. I'm sure you can actually go in this, inside this as well. We can go only from the top. These are smaller, so if we go here, we open the, uh, and I know we can go, because, yeah, there, we can go inside. And here's a small space, restricted, as it is in the tank, and here you have the controller, the driver, with what he sees, and it is actually restricted like that in real times. So if we go out, close the door. So we're done with military equipment, this is the, uh, exit of the base next to the runway of the civilian military airport and let's take the road here and see some of the cars so these are the first uh, type of cars i had uh, built it you see they are a little bit different than the other base a bit longer i like the handles on the doors on the other one over here i would say a these will look good on their own as well this is a different type well, it's the same thing in a different color. When we're coming uh, towards a police vehicle, there you go. How I made a police car with the basic Minecraft structures on scale one to one. I repeat. So let's keep going. I don't think there is much of variety here. It's basically just the color of the cars. There is a taxi. Yeah, that's my taxi. So look how I made the taxi. You can use these ideas to uh, uh, make things for yourself to play. If you post them somewhere, I would appreciate if you uh, put a credit to me. But you can basically get ideas and improve on them. I'll tell you that uh, I have, I, I use, those are all my own, my own ideas. For everything you see, I didn't get any ideas anywhere i just started crafting out of nothing and the only thing actually i copied from the internet was uh, uh, some bathrooms uh, there's uh you can see those at the uh in the aircraft video actually because uh, we got looking at the aircraft base and here's another aircraft base no this is the same okay so we we'll just go see here uh some other uh, some other types of vehicles Is the metro getting up on the land and all that area although undeveloped is part of my city city is built around it 
Okay, so Helic Air, 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 the, this um, helicopters, excuse me, are, are covered in the aircraft video. And for the houses, it will be another one. You see the cars in the uh, carport. Those are all similar, though. I use the technique in uh, Minecraft where you can uh, copy areas. Okay, so here we have the bus. As the stadium covered us again in another video. So if we go down here, these are my buses. I can get in from front, driver. Look at this structures again with all the limitations of one to one and basic structure. I think it's pretty much uh, the best you can do. If you can improve on that. That would be really good. It's always a good thing improving on stuff. And this is, this is the bus station, which obviously is near the stadium and the other stadium over there, which I'm going to make a video sometime soon. It's, it's the Aris Park, is a um, baseball stadium, prison. Yeah, fire department. If you look at the fire department. Uh, but basically, the fire trucks would be. We saw the fire trucks earlier. Then you can see the stairs there coming down for the firemen. I'm going to look at this structure separately though, not to make this too long. Police station. And you say, well, it looks like a square from the other side. Believe me, it has all the areas of the police station inside, and I would know. The police cars, the prison is over there. Some more vehicles over here. And here you see even some uh, vehicles without roof. Or with the sunroof, you can actually put the sunroof, or just leave a hole so you can get it in. Because that's what it does inside a car. And again, Minecraft really likes rainy nights. So. so this is how it looks from the driver's seat, passenger, front passenger seat. This is the back seat. You see, everything I do is is really that's what is the advantage of making everything in scale. You feel you're actually in the world. In that world, not just admire it, you can, you can in a way interact with it. And I believe I have one last vehicle to show you. I believe I had the limo here. Let's check. I don't remember, it's been a while since I constructed these things. And the limo is just a white car now. It's just a. Uh... No, it is a limo. It is a limo actually with four seats at the back. So it's a little bit different, it's a bit longer. And obviously you start with that with the windows being uh, tinted at the back. You can start from this idea and make everything you like. That's the uh, palace, castle, whatever. And uh, that's all about my vehicles. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you. Uh, I hope you see more of my videos. Thank you.